I'm going to show you how to mine Litecoin using your NVIDIA graphics card. So this will only work if you have an NVIDIA graphics card. If you have anything else, uh, you should be looking for another tutorial because this will not work for you. Okay, so first you need to get some mining software. In this case, we're going to be using CC Miner 1.8.3. Uh, I'm going to leave the link in the description down below and once you're in this website you're going to click uh, on this link right here to download the latest CC Miner version. Click that, save the file and it's going to download pretty quick. Uh, once you have it you're going to extract it. And I'm just going to delete the zip version. Okay, we're going to leave this for now. Now uh, you're going to join a pool. We're going to be using litecoinpool.org. I've been using this pool for quite a while now and it's all been very good. So I'm going to leave the link also in the description below. And you're going to click here in join. Okay, so right here, uh, you just need to register. I already have an account, so I'm just going to log in. Okay, so once you're in, you're going to see these uh, things that are called workers. Uh, you're going to have just one. In this case, I got five. And uh, the purpose of this is that you will have one for each mining device that you're going to be using. In this case, if you're going to just use your NVIDIA graphics card, uh, you will only have one worker. So I'm just going to create one more for, for the sake of the tutorial. Uh, the name can be anything and, and the password also can be anything. It doesn't have to be uh, anything uh, fancy. So yeah, add worker and you, and as you can see, it just adds it there. So down here, you would need to get your Litecoin address from your wallet and just paste it there so you can get paid for your work. And also, uh, very important, SegWit support signaling, hit yes if you want to support SegWit, which I encourage you 100%. So yeah, after you do all of that, uh, save your settings. And now you need to go to this place that is called Miner Configuration. I'm going to leave the link also so you can get in faster. Uh, you're going to choose your closest location, uh, the name of your worker, your operating system, in my, in my case it's Windows, of course, and your miner uh, is going to be this one, it's called CUDA Miner for NVIDIA. You're going to generate and you're going to copy all of these. Now, let's go back to our mining software. Uh, double click the folder, get in here, and you have to select uh, depending if your if your system is uh, 32 or 64 bits. In my case, is 64 bits. So now uh, you're going to make a new text document, and you're going to write, and you're going to paste. You're going to paste uh, the thing that you just got from the other site. So now, uh, where it says CUDA Miner, you're going to change it for CC Miner. And then you're going to write uh, up to minus signs, algo, equal, and write script. This is because if, if we're going to be mining Litecoin, we have to specify what is the, the algorithm for the for a program to use. So yeah, that's all we need right here. And now you're going to uh, you're going to close this and hit save. And we're going to give this a name, it can be anything you want. I'm going to put LTC minor. And this is very important, you have to change uh, the extension of the file to bat. 
B-A-T. Uh, if for some reason you cannot change your file extension, you just go to, uh, to your folder configurations. That would be, let me see, uh, I'm using Windows 8 at the moment. And for me, it will be here on view, file name extension, and you have to check that. But if you have, if, if you're on Windows 7, uh, you're going to see here one thing that is called uh, folder options or so, and you're going to go in there and find this same thing, and you have to check that so you can see the, the file extension. Okay, so once you have that, uh, you just double click it, and it's going to take a while. Yeah, maybe, maybe around two to three, five minutes or so. Okay, so after a while you're going to see that it's going to start doing its thing and you should get these yes messages. If you're not, if you're not getting this, it means that it's not working. So in that case, uh, leave a comment and let's see what we can do about it. But if it's saying yes, it means that it worked and you are good to go. Uh, if you check on the website, if you check on the website and you go to my account, you're going to see right here that uh, the speed it's updating and your unpaid rewards are uh, going higher also. So yeah, this is it. Now you're mining Litecoin and also supporting Segwit.